All righty. So here, adding super onto each of the hives today. Had uh, extra medium frames in my hive butlers and came over to open this hive up. You can just hear him roaring. I'm gonna crack this open, see if you can hear him. Might not like the phone. All right, little update here in the bee yard. This is our sunflower hive, uh, formerly known as the 10 frame battalions, but this hive is just busting with activity. They are very active, lots of bees bringing in pollen. Um, yeah, she's looking really good. So they got an extra super, so we're up to three. Those top two are relatively full, and that top one uh, just has a few empty frames and a few that are just wet from the last harvest. Over here, we have our dandelion hive. This was the tiny Italians, and they're doing good. They're calm, surprisingly. They're usually the most active, but they also needed another super on top, so they're up to three. And then over here, we have the Daisy Hive, formerly known as the Corniolans. Uh, lots of activity the whole time since I've been here. Uh, they were very active when I opened the lid up. However, their top super has nothing drawn out in it. So I replaced three of the frames in the top super with three wet frames from the last harvest. Wet meaning that they have a little bit of honey in them after the extraction process. Uh, hopefully that'll help them draw that out. However, their one super there, right above the brood box, the middle box right there, um, is almost completely full of honey. So they are good to go for going into winter with winter stores. It's just giving them the extra room to continue to build and uh, fill out that super if they want. So yeah, that's where we are in the bee yard. All right, while we're here, let's also check our swarm trap. Let's see if there's any activity here. Doesn't look like it. Nope, nothing in the swarm trap yet. Still leave it up though. There's a chance we might get a late season swarm. So here's hoping. <laughs> 